Good day to our viewers right now, mga kapuso, mga kaibigan at mga kapamilya. Today we are going to cook a uh, chicken with pineapple or chicken with gata and pineapple, chicken with coconut or pineapple. So uh, I'll show you how to do it but then we have an important guest right now who came all the way from Singapore to cook with me and for you. Let's welcome Daniel Chan. Hi everyone. <laughs> <laughs> yes, how are you doing, Daniel? I'm good. How yeah? are you? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. So how's the travel? It was good. Um, it was a long drive here, but um, I do like driving that route, and it was kind of fun. But coming here, and you can't really smell it in the video, but you can smell a bit of the wildfires, like as you're here. Yeah. So hopefully the forest fires will die down too. Yes. Yeah. Yes, that's right. Okay, so. This is for you because Daniel Chen is cooking with me today. Okay, just for you, our viewers. So, I had uh, three big chickens and around four kilograms. I cut them and soak it with pineapple juice so that it marinates with the pineapple juice and the juice will be uh, soaked in the chicken and it will gonna be tasty. So yeah, I will put this one aside and then I will ask you to cut sure. some onions. Yes. Do you know how to cut onions? <laughs> yes, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> You're making me nervous. <laughs> so cut onions while we are heating our pan. Our pan. Where is Nana? Nana right now is in Singapore attending oh. the wedding. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. My adopted sibling uh, got married yesterday. Oh, nice. I remember Tito saying once in one of your videos, mm -hmm. say, the happiness of a wife. I know that the happiness for wife is having her man cook for her. Is uh, seeing her man cooking. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> so you really was, eh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember it. Yeah. So, uh, how's life for you? You have a girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> so many. So After many. this video. <laughs> So what's the last cooking video that you did? Uh, I cannot remember. <laughs> <laughs> because it's a, it's a while. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Because I noticed mo your recent videos, yeah. it's a bit more of the traveling stuff. Yes, yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah. You guys have been, been to places yeah. and everything. After the pandemic, after yeah, yeah, yeah. after they opened the borders, yeah. we started uh, traveling. Mm. Because I love traveling. Right? Yeah. And so, yeah, I forget. And then since Nana left, going to the Philippines, she's there now for five months and oh, will be coming home on yeah. September. Ooh. Then we will restart cooking. Because mm. Nana is the one who really is good cook. Yeah. Yeah. I like your, um, I like the videos when you guys went to Ben and Jasper. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I was watching it and it was it really interesting. I've been to yeah. Ben and Jasper yeah. as well, and uh, it's really nice. Yeah. And I've been thinking about taking my parents there. Yeah, as well. yeah, yeah. 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 yeah it's our first time. Me, my first time to go uh, Alberta. Oh, yeah. okay. And that's why I love it. I love going. If I don't have, like, if I have time, I make it a point that the garlic first right. lots of garlic it is because uh, this one smells really good yeah. and smells really in the entire house yeah. and so I pre-cook this one and then so that it would not be very smelly oh, like I mean it would not smell right, into, right, into right. the whole house okay. but it will incorporate in the meat and it will gonna be delicious right, right? right. Okay. even though it's not too smell oh, smelly I yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. again after that you can put that one okay. yeah I 
think that's good. Okay. Then we'll put the meat. Okay, sure. You wanna do it? Sure. Like just the meat only. Okay. Let's put the, uh, the uh, yeah, pineapple. Sauce. Okay, yeah. sure. Yeah. This meat has been uh, marinated in pineapple. So. Mm. So what kind of chicken do you use? Like, is it just all parts this, of the This chicken? is a whole I mean? chicken. Like I mean, a whole chicken and just remove the um, the vertebrae, okay. like the uh, backbone. Okay. Okay. Cool. And uh, remove some of the skin. Okay. I, there are some skins, but most yeah. of the skins that mm. are loose, I remove. It. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Uh, let's put a little bit of fishes. About uh, three. Okay. Tablespoon. Okay, I've seen this thing a lot in your videos. This <laughs> magical piece of saucepan equipment. So I've been looking for something like this for a long time. Yeah. Because I have like a frying pan. Yeah. But it's very shallow. Oh. So like sometimes when I put stuff in it, oh, it yeah. does not deep enough to put stuff. Oh. So yeah, when I saw that in the channel, yeah. and like every time I see the video, I'm like, yep, it's that saucepan. That's yep. the one. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one. Yeah, the famous saucepan. <laughs> I like using this one, even though I, I, I cook small mm. or cook large. Yeah. I normally use this one because mm. it doesn't m mess my uh, kitchen mm. because it's so deep, right? Yeah, yeah. It's deep enough, not too very deep, but it's just perfect. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, we'll leave it as it is first. Okay. Yeah. So do you cook often? Like, do you cook every day? Uh, every day I cook. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. Is it difficult? <laughs> At first, yeah. I'm not, I have five, four siblings, mm. I'm in the middle. Yeah. My mom is really a cook. Yeah. She is very good cook. But then when I am growing up, I not liking cooking. Yeah. Because my siblings like cooking. Yeah. So they are in the kitchen. Yeah. I'd rather go outside of the kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> I help by cutting. Yeah. So I did not really grow up like cooking with my mom. Yeah. But my sibling does. Yeah, yeah. And so I uh, when I got married I started cooking. <laughs> I started asking my siblings hey, how to cook this one, how to do this one. Nice. And so my sibling keeps saying, yeah because you did not <laughs> you did not go and uh, like like you did not go to learn yeah yeah, yeah. okay mom has a restaurant mm. oh okay okay so uh, because uh, my mom has a restaurant it still needs help mm. but i didn't yeah. <laughs> so, yeah in singapore um outside food is very cheap Oh. and accessible. My mom would go out, order takeout and bring yeah. home. Yeah. And it's a very common thing for Singaporeans to do yeah. because it's so cheap. Like you can get a decent meal for like four or five dollars. Yeah, yeah. You you know, you come home from work, you're tired. Yeah. And say you and your wife, you're both working, you're both tired. You just go out, order something back home. And like, it's very easy because you can just walk to the place to buy. So growing up, I actually ate outside food a lot. And I hardly cooked, my family hardly cooked. So the first time I really started cooking regularly or learned cooking yeah. was when I came here to Canada five years ago. Yeah, Gordon Ramsay was my teacher. <laughs> I still watch all his YouTube videos and everything. And like, you know, you make all those stupid mistakes, right? Like I learned that you cannot put plastic container in like a conventional oven because if not, it will melt. Yeah, stuff like that. I really uh, did cooking too when I came here mm. in Canada. Oh. This is <laughs> so it doesn't matter to me. So when I eat here, I would like to I would like to try the food that was I cannot just buy in here. Yeah, yeah. So I need to cook. Yeah. And I call, hello, how to cook this one? <laughs> hello siblings, how to, how can I cook this one? Yeah, yeah. yeah and so I think this one is good and then let's put this sure. one. Maybe that it's similar, I guess? Yeah, yeah, similar. Sometimes I find it like creamier to use the coconut uh, milk okay. instead of uh, milk. Okay, okay. There are two things like one is uh, milk, evaporated milk, yeah. and another one is the coconut uh, milk. But then if you don't have a coconut milk, you can use evaporated milk, no yeah. problem with okay. that, right? Okay. But then if I will choose, I rather uh, put coconut. Yeah, mm. because it became it becomes more creamier. Yeah, yeah. yeah okay. So. Then 
time we are going to put pineapple tidbits this time but there is like pineapple chunk yeah. chunks is bigger than tidbits because okay. our chicken is bigger yeah and so it's better if pineapple chunks but if you don't have pineapple chunks because i went to superstores and there's no pineapple chunks yeah. so pineapple oh, could be, tidbits, would okay. be fine okay yeah okay. Okay. so okay. no problem with that yeah. Fish sauce. So is there a reason you use fish sauce? I always sauce? use fish sauce. My mom said yeah. it's uh, it's become more tasty. Oh, okay, okay. Than just ordinary sauce. Yeah. It adds different flavor. Okay, okay. So, 